In this tutorial, we'll walk through calling the OpenAI API using JavaScript and Node.js. To complete this tutorial, you will need access to the OpenAI API and an account on replit.com. First, log in to replit.com. If you don't have an account, create one. Next, open a new browser tab and go to github.com slash dabblelab. Search for repositories containing the word OpenAI and select the one named calling dash the dash OpenAI dash API dash node. On the repository readme page, find the run on replit button and click on it. This will copy the code from the GitHub repository to your replit.com account. Next, log into your OpenAI account. Then, under your account avatar, select the View API Key option. Choose an existing key, or create a new one, and copy the value to your clipboard. Go back to replit.com, and click on the Create Secret button on the left menu. It's the button with the padlock icon. For the key name, enter OpenAI, underscore API, underscore key. Then, paste in the value of your OpenAI secret key, and click the Add New Secret button. With your API key set, you'll be able to run the code by clicking the Run button. The first time you click Run, Replit will install some code dependencies. So you'll have to wait for that process to finish. But after the dependencies install, you should see a JSON response from the API. The code in index.js is making the API call. The first line loads the library that is used to make HTTP requests. Lines 3 through 7 create an HTTP client instance and sets the authorization header using our API key. The input parameters for the API request are defined on lines 9 through 12 in the params object. The code on lines 14 through 19 make a request to the completions endpoint and logs the response to the console. In this example, the DaVinci engine is being used and the prompt text is once upon a time. To send something other than once upon a time, just change the prompt text on line 10 and click the run button again. Well that's it for this tutorial. If you found it helpful, please let us know with a like or comment. Thanks so much for watching.